Good morning, this is Drew with DRC Enterprises of Central Florida and today in another segment of Adobe Photoshop CS6 I'm going to show you how to enter file metadata information um, like copyright information for a picture, where it was taken, a description, so on and so forth. Um, for those of you that are into web uh, design or you're using pictures for websites and you want that picture uh, Photographs, pictures can come up in Google, Bing, Yahoo searches, just like uh, information can. So with me, you know, if a client types in, my full-time professional job is a professional fishing guide here in East Central Florida. I specialize in saltwater fly fishing, inshore flats fishing on the Mosquito Lagoon. So when a client types in inshore fishing guide near Orlando, and all of a sudden images come up, I want my images to come up. That's how I network my business. So, like with this photograph here, this is a Mosquito Lagoon redfish um, caught by a young lady here in East Central Florida with me a few weeks ago. And I'm going to enter the, the description and the uh, copyright info because I want that picture to travel from here on out for the rest of its life with info attached to it. This is my picture. And so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go over here to File. You're going to come down to File Info. And you can do this on your pictures regardless. Uh, one day you may go back and look at the picture and you can say, oh, I remember that. Look at that. We took that picture there. Uh, say you took a picture and you like the way it turned out. One thing up here is all these are a lot of information. Uh, the GPS data, um, if I'm not mistaken, I believe you can enter this manually somehow. I believe this is designed for cameras that come with the GPS, um, you know, uh, information automatically uh, added to the memory. My camera does not. My camera does not do that, so I won't use this. But you can go back and you can look at the. Uh, the can the, you can see I used the Canon, the focal length, the lens, you know, so on and so forth. You know, the exposure, the ISO, so on and so forth. So, the main thing I'm going to enter is the description, and I've already put in some of the stuff up here. So we got Orlando Saltwater Fishing Charters. My name, Captain Drew Cavanaugh. My title, the Mosquito Lagoon Fishing Guide. The description. I'll just space that out just a little bit there. Make that proper grammar. Uh, so on and so forth. The keywords, I'm going to add a couple keywords. I'm going to add uh, Orlando Fishing Guide. I'm going to add Orlando Saltwater Fishing. I'm going to add uh, Beach Fishing. That's about it for this picture. Actually, I'm going to add Mosquito Lagoon. The copyright status always comes up as default as unknown. We're going to copyright this. Uh, technically, it's not registered with the copyright, uh, you know, the U.S. federal government, so on and so forth. But this is enough to tell people, you know, hey, you know, it kind of scares them a little bit or kind of gives them some information. A lot of people see it and they don't know. Uh, copyrighted. I'll give it a five star rating because I took the picture. And the copyright, here's how you put the little C emblem with the circle. You hit Alt, A L T, then 0169. So Alt 0169. And there you go. And you can see I've already used it a few times. And technically, it should go like this the, the copyright should come first. If you look down here on my pictures, I've been doing it like that for a long time and I just never really changed it. I should change it. So. And then we'll go on here, and it's this top one. You can see I made a mistake one day, and I put three T's. So once you do this, it's wise to check it at times. Um, I've already checked it, so we're good to go. All the information looks good. We'll hit OK. Now, you could save this as a template also, but eh, six, one, half a dozen, another. So we'll hit OK. And if we're done from there, you would just go over to here, file, and save it as you want. So again, I want to thank you, and everybody have a great day. That's how you enter file info.